<coughs> you gotta understand the first place that it went export, where they exported it, mm -hmm. was this new country called Ta -da. the U.S. Ta -da. Virginia it wasn't even a country yet; it was just Virginia. Right. Virginia was its own. They didn't, you know, it was, mm -hmm. it was Virginia. Yeah. And that's where they exported the first slaves to. To show you, yeah, this slavery shit. We all gonna gee off on this, and damn if they didn't. Yeah. So, yeah, I, I, you know the whole thing. I always talk about that reparation shit, but you know, people. What? I just feel it's our responsibility to speak on. It may not come in my lifetime. Right. You know, they may have wiped us all out, except for a fucking busload. Uh huh. But if it's just that left, then they. I want them to get reparations. I, I'm gonna speak on it. I know. No, I mean, and if before people used to treat it like it was a joke. Yeah. And and something so far fetched that you know, <laughs> but right. it's, it's not a joke. It's and, not a joke. And it's and not far fetched. The conversation is not I mean, going away. Done. Right. It's got to be mm -hmm. done. It, it would... does not break the country. No. Oh no. It doesn't like break the country. Right. No. They always love to say that. Yeah. Like, motherfucker, how could you break some motherfuckers that make up money? Right. Yeah. The fuck out of here. <laughs> right. Exactly. That is not that conversation. She had it. She had it. Right. And what do you motherfuckers yeah, do? Uh, they, want, they want to tell them that, hey, fuck, with this money, we get them. Right. Stop. That's that, exactly. You know. Just so like they. they people against. The same, and this is what kills me. You realize the same motherfuckers that just got bailed out a few years ago. Yes. Are the same precise yes. motherfuckers who cheat off due to slavery. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Motherfucker, man, cut, cut these assholes loose, man. Get them out of here. We don't, I don't give a fuck if, if they, they think this country is as far as a superpower and all of that. Mm -hmm. Man, that's hype. Any real superpower come over and get to slapping motherfuckers. They ain't got to touch nobody. All they got to do is just take take away Wi-Fi. <laughs> the whole country will drop to its knees. <laughs> wait, wait, you guys have to post something. I want to post my picture of the weekend. Yeah. Right. That shit just happened on the airplane. Wi-Fi went out in the beginning. You should have seen Wi-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> and then they got loud. Hey, Wi-Fi. Right. right. Like motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck the Wi-Fi. Yes. Are the wings working on this bitch? How about that? <laughs> That's the shit that kills me. That? I, I, I don't give a fuck what's wrong. I don't give a fuck. If Peanuts are stale. I don't give a fuck if the soda's flat. Yep. I don't give a fuck if you don't have milk, tea. Yep. I don't give a fuck about any of that shit. <laughs> Just make sure this motherfucker takes off, right. flies, right. and lands. Oh That's the only I want all monies to go to that. Yeah. Everything else, you're kidding yourself. And keep that motherfucker away at the Right, right, right. Be, I, you know, autopilot. Had, they 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 find was, more on oh. autopilot than anything. I tell you, I traveled so much between the year 2006 and 2013. Oh my gosh! They they was off the chain. I was my kids. I was able to fly them back and forth from LA to New York. Or my That's daughter great. was my oldest daughter was in college at the time. She was in Baltimore or in Maryland anyway. But she was flying back and forth. It was all off of them fucking. I had miles. I was getting to use. It was. Shh. It got to the point, man, that I had all the perk. Every single perk you can get. Going in the room. Going in the fucking, the big ass, uh, the own special waiting room. Yeah. Lounges. Yeah. Lounge. Yeah. We were in yeah. Australia. We were in the special waiting room. These motherfuckers had some hot dogs. Free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's what we was like. Yo, Charlie, like, yo, froze. Hot dogs, nigga. <laughs> hot dogs. Man, he had a hot Hot dog in a long time, nigga. I was like, hell yeah, I was with it. You know, my fat ass, I was real big at that time. I was like, hell yeah, let's go. Good old hot dog. Man, we got those hot dogs. It was bullshit. It wasn't even hot dog. How do you have a hot dog that's not a hot dog? Hot dog's already bullshit. Well, where were you? We were in Australia. Well, These motherfuckers go. were like, um, they were like, like, uh, like they they totally got the idea wrong, motherfucker. It's not <laughs> just how it wrong. looks. Huh? It's not just you know how it looks like a you know tube of meat. No, these motherfuckers had like um. You ever get that fucking meat that's like a paste? 
Oh, yeah, yeah, like yeah. some fucking liverwurst. Like liverwurst? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, these was liverwurst dogs, man. Wait, so they weren't even encased the, in anything? Yeah, they was, they was encased was in the outside. Like that, when, uh, the outside was cooked. It had the lines on them. <coughs> Shit looked like cartoon, not like the mm. idea of them. They had mustard. The perfect it was oh, like biting no, into no. liverwurst. Like, what the fuck are y'all eating? That's a hot dog. Get the fuck oh, out of here, oh man. God. Leave hot dogs to Nathan's, man. <laughs> or Hebrew National. <laughs> Ballpark Frank's. <laughs> and, and then you got to take, those are only for grilling. Uh-huh. Or Frank's. You, you do them shits in a skillet with Frank's. But whatever you do to them, they got to be burnt. They got to have a yeah. little charness yeah. on them. That's but I want a hot link. I don't want hot dogs. Yeah, hot link. Thing too, whatever the, anything like that has got to be partly burnt to me. Burn yeah, you need burnt. that char. Yeah, that nice, yeah. That's what makes it work. Uh, you know, and it's all comes from fucking Germans. You know, they got the knockwurst. And the, did you yeah. ever have liverwurst sandwiches? Yeah, hell yeah, I did. I did too. I did with mustard, <laughs> but it was like I knew I what was I was I was eating. Yeah, like, like was I was prepared. Well, what, what, what was, was the, this? Is what potted was the little meat. white right. strip around the edge? I never, I can't. Fat. Remember. Fat. That was just yeah, regular. Yeah, take that. That's some old fashioned shit. I remember eating. I can remember eating those motherfuckers on the beach bus, going going from Altadena all the way to the beach. Did you ever ride that bus? Man, all the homies, we would we was we was going to get the fucking liverwurst and the um, uh, all that bullshit ass man. Shit's a bullshit. I know. But you're a kid, so you can do that. Yeah. yeah we'll yeah. put the uh, mustard all on that shit. Syrup sandwiches. You ever have syrup sandwiches? Syrup sandwich. Hell yes. <laughs> syrup sandwich. Sugar and butter sandwiches. Yeah. Yeah. And my wife be having those every once. I'm like, come on. Sugar. She be like, come she be like on. fuck that. <laughs> I'm <just> Brooklyn <laughs> in the house. <laughs> Yeah. It's like when you need it, right. you need it. Shut yeah, up. You need it, you need it. <laughs> I mean, that's what butter agree. Yeah, that's what, you know, hey, man, I've, I've had, Did some, you? I had cereal with water. Oh, that is so gross to me. I can't. No. Well, you know, I have a thing about cereal. If you don't eat it immediately. Oh, yeah, I remember that. I remember soggy. us I having this. the bowl. I can't. It's all kind of shit. Yeah, it people needs to have be eaten, like, issues. right away while it's Like, crying. see, I eat my cereal with a little bit of milk. Uh-huh. I don't even use milk. I use almond milk now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. oh I like almond milk. milk. Yeah, yeah. yeah shit, Not in coffee, you, though. Yeah, get, if you milk got milk in your milk. life, cut that shit out, man. Yeah. I lost a lot of weight just by fuck, by cutting milk and mm-hmm. all that dairy. That shit For is real. fucking mucus, man. Yeah. yeah. From yeah. an animal. I mean, you have to really, it really, you know, someone had to really break it the fuck down. Right. Like, yeah. listen, man, you are a grown human. Why are you sucking on an animal's titty to drink something? What the fuck is wrong with you? Well, babies do it. Babies suck on their mother's Mother. breast. Yep. Right. Oh, okay. Their mother's a human. A human. Right. Oh, you're saying because it's uh, We're as fucking human as an animal. Yeah. You don't really even need milk. Our yeah. bones is milk. Isn't that a trip, though, how they always made you believe you needed milk? Oh, that little food like, chart? Yeah. yeah. That yeah. shit is some bullshit. The pyramid of bullshit. The pyramid of bullshit. That's exactly they what They got all is. kind of bullshit. I believe they had corn on that motherfucker. <laughs> corn ain't got no fucking <laughs> nutritional <laughs> value whatsoever. It's a grass. It's, cor- it's a grass. It's a grass. That, no, I, that's crazy. Um, okay, well, I guess we should just jump on. Start it? <coughs> okay, I'm gonna let, okay, welcome. That's your cough. Dun, 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 dun. Whoa, what up, everybody? What up? <laughs> uh, we're still trying to get started. Welcome, 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 welcome. You see what it's about, baby? What it's gonna be about. <laughs> Put it in the air show. Yeah. <laughs> you said put, put it in the, in air. the air. And also had a motherfucking edible. Oh, oh yes. okay. So you, you just rolled just it right like, in the right place right now. <laughs> <laughs> just going with it. Going with it. Like, yeah. 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 What's weaponized media? What's that? Oh, this is the homie. This is my homie, Amon Lee. This is, this is you know, I'm from a very big hip-hop clique. Mm-hmm. Out to the end of Pasadena, parts of LA, called 360, mm-hmm. 360 degrees production. Our shit is so big that we, we don't even, there's portions of us that don't like each other. <laughs> That's how big other. it is. But we all 360, and this is one of the little homies, one of the young homies that's just, we got generations 
of hip hop mm -hmm. heads from California. I mean, hip hop heads, nigga. Mm -hmm. Like hip hop, yeah. every asset, facet, angle yeah. of it. Mm -hmm. Live it. Don't talk it. Been living it. And this is one of the young homies' company, motherfucking uh, weaponized media. It's not his company. It's a design. It's a That's dope. He, yeah. So check him out on on Instagram, Aman Lee. Mm -hmm. Ahmad Lee, this is my homie Jamal's little brother. So we keep it all in the nice. in the big the big tree of 360 right. or one way or another. I got a lot of homies, and you know, uh, I don't even want to get into it. Yeah, but fuck them. So promote. Fuck y'all. Okay, so fuck y'all, and y'all know who y'all are. Y'all know who y'all are. I love you. I love you, but fuck you. <laughs> All the times you ain't said nothing about freeze. It was like, oh, you you stop. You're doing comedy, nigga. Who, this who said that? Other, other homies. I got homies be like oh. mad that I stopped rhyming and all of that shit. But I'm like, bitch, I never stopped. Oh, right. I just stopped. It was not on the front burner. Right. You got to go with what's going. The mm -hmm. comedy was going, so I rolled with that That's shit. That's right. Been rolling with it. But the hip hop never stopped either. That's always That's you know, in you. Always. That's always. That's, That's always in you. It's my culture. Yeah. That's why I never changed the name Freeze Love. Mm -hmm. I never, they were like, well, you know, it would be a lot better if you went with Paul Farmer. Mm -hmm. Why, nigga? Fuck you. I'm going with Freeze Love. Freeze Love is cool. Paul Farmer is cool. Right. I do both. I don't, I'm not one of these, hey, don't, don't call don't me call. Paul <laughs> Farmer. Man, I'm Paul Farmer. Paul G. Farmer. Oh, yeah. Right. And Freeze Love, whatever. You know me by, when people yell out my name, that's how I know they know me. So the gays call, they're okay with you using Paul too. They don't really have a choice. <laughs> Cause in that in that in that essence is Big Paul, Uncle Paul, Paul. Okay. Paul, okay. Big Paul. Big Paulie. You know they they did. I was around before they. This is new. Okay. And also I like to add a couple of names to that too. Oh, okay. Just just they, to keep wait, it fair. Names that the gays took. Yeah, or? they okay. took. Okay. Myron. My, oh, Myron. 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 Okay, they took Myron. Uh, was another one. Oh, and Maurice. 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 Yeah, they're getting that one. That's. <laughs> is is it gone or? I was with close? Maurice. Really? <laughs> <laughs> you trying to tell us, man? Mo Maurice. Mo. Mo, that's what uh, when it was when I first got to New York, they was like, "Yo, dude, is a mo." I'm like, "A mo? Right. The right. fuck is a mo?" You know, homo. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, homo sapien, motherfucker. Yeah. No homo, homo. <laughs> a mo, mo. Yo, son is a mo. Yeah. Oh, hey man. Whatever the fuck floats your boat. You're not gonna be doing it in my bedroom. Whatever the fuck. Yeah, hey, whatever it is. is. We we'll do what it. I do in my bedroom right. with my wife. Period. And it's lovely, goddammit. Are there any other names that you need to add? Um, uh, let's see. Tristan. Tristan. Yeah, if your name is Tristan, just go to West Hollywood, man. <laughs> Tristan, Tristan. Sorry, homie. It, right. it ain't your fault. Or, or right. maybe you're happy. Maybe you're celebrating. Yeah, he gave me my props. You know, maybe. Yeah, Tristan. Tristan. Tristan, Paul, Kyle, Brian, Maurice. And what was the other one I said? Uh, uh, Maurice. Maurice and Myron. 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 Jerome. Jerome. See, Jerome's iffy. There's a lot of ashy niggas named Jerome that are, they can scrap and all of that shit. Did we like a really lot of niggas start, named Jerome like, fix did, cars? Did you do the intro? Did we? Hey, <laughs> welcome to Freeze Talk with the delayed intro, baby. Yeah, that was fly. We did that. We're welcome. My name is Freeze something. Love, comedian. <laughs> This is our co-host, Linda Hamblin Denton, writer extraordinaire. We have the mad laugher, and we have the laugher's journeyman, Mr. Ray's Denton and Dominique Brown. Okay. There we go. Now, we're now the particulars are. Yeah. And, of course, we have you, the audience. Yeah, the best part. It was definitely a part of our Just Get Down. Right on. Yes. Thank you all for being here. All and also, I just got to reiterate, I'm a comedian. Yes. <laughs> a very good one. Motherfuckers, you know, hey, a lot of motherfuckers be like, freeze, man. I'm in a crazy relationship. <laughs> My girl is Nigga, you're asking me? Oh, let me tell you, homie. I'm going a, I'm to a give you some info. Are you asking a comedian some important shit? I mean, but you, you know, do have really good. I, granted, I make sense because I'm a comedian and all of this. Yeah, but, but you know what I'm saying? This shit ain't going to hold up in court. Like, and where did you get this information? A comedian. 
A comedian told me to say this. Oh. It just now hit me. <laughs> never mind, never mind. Right, never right. mind. Oh, it, back. it made so much sense. Yeah, it makes sense. It does make sense, but you know, this world don't make sense. Right. This world is fucked up. I'm going to give you some great information, and this shit's going to sound great when I'm giving it to you, but when you try to apply that shit, that's when the, the, this came from a comedian Part. starts showing. <laughs> But you, you give know. good advice. You I do, I good. guess. I you're, hope you're I do. It's from the heart. Yeah. It's from the heart. Yeah. I'm never going to try to, uh, you know, um, steer someone wrong. Right. Why are you laughing when I, I said that? That, like, that was all like, <laughs> <laughs> Watch him tell this lie. <laughs> 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 you guys want to hear from me? Uh, Not really. Like, what? Talking. No, no, we don't. What? We can roll without it. There it is. You is can't give them an inch. See, that was a ploy. They've been that, practicing yes. this shit. It is going to be think some I don't long, know long, long essay. Right, right, right. right. Every yeah. fucking <laughs> Saturday, Sunday, they hook up and they go over they're, what they're going to do today. They're making plans. They're making plans. Now, what I'm going to do is give a delayed laugh. <laughs> Just roll with it. <laughs> what are you going to do? with it? Just to roll with it. I'm going to act like... You'd like to know, but we'd have to talk. <laughs> see where I'm getting? Oh, that's brilliant. It <laughs> ain't brilliant. I see y'all. <laughs> Good catch. Oh, see, they, 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 they play us we against. Gotta, we got to stay on our when, toes, When they're working on you, then, you know, I got them. Okay. So when they're working on me, I you can't you. go with it. Like, no. oh, let's hear from you. You know, no. you got to be on your toes. I was on it. <laughs> These I guys are it. sneaky, man. You think. Who the fuck makes a living out of laughing except some sneaky motherfucker? That's right. There they are. There they are. Everyone there else are. going to work and shit. These niggas. Shit. All right. In the mirror. Right. Right in the mirror. Yeah. They don't know what they're missing by not showing us. That's right. Oh That's right. Right. Okay, so we have, I have a, a, a pet peeve. This is this Dude. is something that was really in a store. Um, whenever I hear it, it makes me so angry. That's past a pet peeve. It just pisses me off. So there was a story in, um, in Pennsylvania where these letters went out to the school district uh, families in the school district telling hundreds of parents that they owed lunch money for their children and if they didn't pay up the children would be sent to foster care. What? what? Right. And so it, the, the letter was not a real letter but it was and they told them that your child has been sent to school every day without money and without breakfast or lunch and the failure to provide children with food could result in your parents um, the kids being sent to dependency court and, and put away. Now this was all fake. The, right. it, 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 the letter was bullshit, okay. and the, and the, everybody responded. But that whole concept of you're dealing with poor families and they're not able to pay whatever the lunch bill is or the breakfast bill is, and then you want to shame the children, shame the parents, and it's like, what? It I I can't even get with that. I don't. I, I'm beyond pissed off because we're talking about food. And we're talking about kids. Right. And then you'll throw food away, but you won't give the kid who didn't have the lunch money the hot yeah. lunch. You'll right. give him like a liverwurst sandwich or some shit like that. Man, I'm going to tell you, whoever whoever thought of that letter, you need to be publicly shamed. Yeah. For real. You personally. You know, I, I always look at that kind of shit. <laughs> I have a fucking crazy mind. Do tell. Because when shit like that pops up with me, it's certain a lot of shit that just is like a pet peeve. Mm -hmm. I always go back to that fucking scene in um, The Untouchables. Mm -hmm. Remember, or not The Untouchables. Was it The Untouchables with um, about, about the about um, baseball bat? No, 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 not, not The Untouchables. The uh, the other motherfucker. The uh, Usual suspects? No, no, no. I'll get it in a He's minute. Uh, what the fuck? Good, good fellas. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, the, yeah. And the whole, okay. Mm -hmm. Good fellas. When the fucking dude across the street had uh, tried some shit on a date with the girl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And she told my man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he said, and I, okay, good. And then he went across the street and said, hey, you touch this girl? Yeah, well, and he beats the fuck out of his ass. Mm-hmm. I know for certain that whoever does little shit like that, that that same kind of shit could happen to them. Right. They're that type of people. Right. So I always just kind of visualize 
the motherfucker who wrote that. What's my man's name? That Ray actor Liotta. Ray Liotta just busted into their <laughs> office with the bat and beating his shit out their ass. Right. Like that right. makes me feel good. That's how I get over shit like that. Right. For a few minutes anyway. For a few minutes. And then you realize you gotta do something. You know, to the people in that community, you shouldn't let that slide, man. Well, I hope they're able to find out, you know, who was behind yeah. it. Um, but I just, this thought of, you know, you're talking about children who don't have any control over the circumstances you know, and then we want to ration food <coughs> based on, because the cafeteria will turn the kid away and they'll throw the food away yeah. at you the know, end of the day. Exactly. So that when makes I, no you know, sense. Let me tell you, when I was a kid, I had what was called reduced lunch. Yeah. You I had reduced real? lunch. I, I did too. I had I reduced did. lunch. Right. All it meant was that I paid 20 cents. Yeah. Mm hmm. Okay. And I can remember feeling that I was the shit. Like, hey, I, I'm not as poor as you. <laughs> Your meal's free. <laughs> they looked at my parents and come like, I gotta pay 20 cents. <laughs> like, first of all, nigga, <laughs> all the rich motherfucking kids ain't even at your school. Right. Yeah, first of all. <laughs> Period. <laughs> And the ones who were, because we had some money. I was in Pasadena. That's one thing. That our shit was very integrated. We grew mm -hmm. up very integrated. Mm -hmm. e economically integrated, racially integrated, religious, mm -hmm. all of that shit. We had kids from all types of shit. Mm -hmm. But I can remember the motherfuckers. I can remember wanting to go to the pergola. Remember the pergola? What's you know pergola? what the, the pergola, see? That's how fucking. See, you got to grow up around white kids to know what a pergola is. <laughs> the pergola. The Perculas is a motherfucking bullshit ass area where they got a roof and some benches and tables. It's just a roof oh, table area. Oh, at the park, area. like the little yeah. cupboards. Yeah, oh. the school has a and pergola, it, oh. and all the little motherfuckers, all the kids who who had any who had bread and shit, was getting homemade lunches because their parents wasn't playing that shit. They wasn't, you know. Whereas me, I had to pay twenty cents. <laughs> Some niggas have free. Whatever. You had a fucking big ass motherfucking ticket that you yeah, had to carry. Mm -hmm. Right, so it was all what do you mean shame, motherfucker? Right. This shit has been going on. This ain't nothing new. Right. You think they didn't write me a motherfucking letter? They wrote our ass a letter. They said, look, motherfucker. <laughs> if your motherfucking kid don't turn into motherfucking <laughs> something. Then the motherfucking and that's how come I, that's how come I had to pay twenty cent because that shit was late. I remember if I'd have just done the paperwork, I'd have got my shit free. But you know, niggas was lagging, thought they was bullshitting up at the lunch house. It wasn't bullshit. Niggas put a tax on my ass. You get two dimes every day, motherfucker. And they wasn't throwing shit away. Matter of fact, mark my word, anybody from Altadena. They were taking it home. No, no, one motherfucker. A nigga named Mr. Marble. A janitor. The head Mr. janitor, Marble. Mr. Marble. Mr. Marble used to stand at the fucking edge of the cafeteria with buckets. He said, no, 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 no. Don't put that in the trash. You put that right here. Put that right here in this bucket. I mean, what the fuck are you going to do with this? With, like, uh, cartons of milk that weren't open? No, nah, he was taking it. He was, he, was, he, was, he was gaffling all that shit. But what could he be? Was he big? He said the food was for his dogs. Oh. He's feeding his dogs. Oh. Which, let me tell you something. That's smart. If you're a janitor and you see him throwing that shit away. Of course. Fuck it. At least give it to the dogs. He mm -hmm. probably had some. Mr. Marble probably had some bullshit dogs. Y'all know Mr. Marble. Let's, Mr. Marble looked like fucking like, like Lou Gossett and who else? Not just Lou Gossett. He had a tinge of fucking. If you could imagine Lou Gossett and Raj from What's Happening, you know what? if those motherfuckers blended together, that would be Mr. Marble. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Oh my. And Mr. Marble, that motherfucker always has some motherfucking green polyester slacks oh, and oh fucking yeah. green silk shirts with yeah. the fucking million keys come and shit. Oh yeah. He was important than a motherfucker. Oh. Ah, 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 ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come here. You know, goddamn where will you put that? Put oh. that in the bucket. Put that in the bucket. Yeah. Uh huh. Hey, 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 hey. Come here, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> now why I got to tell you every day? You know every day that go in that bucket if you don't eat it. Oh. Well, shit, I was a cafeteria. In the cafeteria? Yeah, motherfucker. Mm -hmm. 
I don't, but I don't remember nobody ever getting turned away saying that they would never eat. I don't that remember that. Happen. I mean, it, it may have happened. You know? I don't know. And but if you if you are a type now. person that would ever deny a child food, food, and you're an adult and you deny a child food, I hope a fucking brick land can just out of nowhere off the tallest building crushes your dome. I hope yeah. that you filthy bastard. How would you ever deny a child food? That if you no see a child that's hungry, motherfucker, that's, you know in Swahili there's no such word as hunger. Mm. Really? There is no word to def it does not translate. There's no word. Right. It doesn't mean anything because it it it's, no one's gonna no one ever is supposed to be in that position. Mm -hmm. If we got food, you got food. Right. This is food, that's, motherfucker. We're talking about food. Right. food. Food, water, shelter. Those are the three primary right. things. That's how come I don't. Like the you know the the whole homeless situation, oh, yeah. you know the bleeding hearts and they get them a house, man. Fuck that. Give these motherfuckers some tanks and some fucking fifty cows. That's what they need. If you gave these motherfuckers anything like that, I'll bet you they'll take your shit because that's how fucking desperate it is. Mm -hmm. People don't understand. People don't. The fact that people don't have homes, mm -hmm. and the fact that we're talking about people don't have homes. Steps away from multi-billion dollar right. corporations that are operating in this country legally mm -hmm. is is illegal. Right. That should be illegal. Whatever establishment allows that should be held accountable Getting for that every being tax illegal. Break possible. Yeah, fuck out of here. Everything you can Getting do. Getting everything. Mm -hmm. That's that's just like that's that's corporation gonna ride. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's no person ahead of that. Mm -hmm. There's mm -hmm. just a bunch of dummies that are robots. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't be in the position they're at if they weren't robots. Mm -hmm. You understand? Right. So it, it, they 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 do good, but that's the corporation's job. It's, you know, I'm I'm just one of these motherfuckers. It's like I believe corporations are great as long as they're not people. When you start saying a corporation is a person, yeah. you fucked up, and that's mm -hmm. when our country flipped. Yeah. That's some bullshit. And the motherfuckers that made it do that did it illegally. So why in the fuck are we sitting here? Going through all this bullshit, mm -hmm. whatever we're going through, you could almost say we kind of deserve going through it because, motherfucker, ain't nobody, who's making us do this? Mm -hmm. When do we pump our brakes and stop? It doesn't have to be violent. It really has to be, you know, the real thing that it has to be is loving. Mm -hmm. If That's you love true. a motherfucker, then how could you let a motherfucker starve? How could you sit up and say shit like, I'm a humanitarian? And you don't but, deserve medical care. You don't deserve But this person welfare. deserves to be yeah. put in a cage yeah. and thrown out of the country. Right. Are you out of your fucking mind? Mm -hmm. Man, come on, man. And we sit here. <gasps> man, I'm not with all of that. Yeah. Fuck your post, man. Yeah. Don't post shit unless you're doing something. Yeah, I agree. I'm to that point. I'm sick of posting. I think more and more posting. people are getting to that point. It's like people who perhaps were on the sidelines about a lot of the social and political issues going on and didn't say anything because they didn't want to get into it with other people right. i think more and more people are coming out of that and feeling like i, <laughs> I need to, to say something they have to because in whatever my circle is if you have any sliver of humanity yeah. humanity in you mm -hmm. you cannot sit up here and watch other human beings constantly get fucked over right. and act like Shit is all hunky dory. Yeah. If you're doing that, understand you are a fucking nut. And you need help, motherfucker. I'm not a nut. I'ma speak on it. The whatever. Whatever I could do. Right. Sometimes I can't do shit but tell a motherfucker, yo, you are so funky, I'll kill you, nigga. <laughs> Stay where you are, nigga. <laughs> Sometimes right. I keep it one hundred with you. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I look here. I'm gonna throw you. I'm gonna throw you a dollar. I'm gonna throw you a dollar. <laughs> yeah. Throw you some soap. Some soap. That's and fucked I'm up. You some love. I make fun. Of it. I joke about it only because I want motherfuckers to talk about it. Right. This shit is bullshit. Forty-four percent of the homeless motherfuckers in this country are African American descent. Mm. African descendants of slaves. Whatever you want to say. Mm -hmm. And also, then they say we're 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 doing what we've opened a lot of businesses this year. Great, that's great. But all I'm saying is some some of this shit is our responsibility. Right. We want it to be our responsibility. Because if it's not our responsibility, that's when that other slick hand jumps in. <laughs> I can make sure that the bums get soap. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Let me take it to them. Mm -hmm. Nah, they ain't going to get all the soap. Yeah. They're not. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why all of those, you know, a lot of these uh, big uh, uh, charity organizations, mm -hmm. motherfuckers is dying because this shit is caught up in red tape because everybody wants the fucking credit. Right. So that they can flip it some other way. And I understand a lot of times that's how you get shit. Is if it wasn't that incentive, they wouldn't do it at all. Okay, well, how about this? If you tax the motherfucker for not doing it extremely heavy, right. they, do, they do it then too. That's right. Mm -hmm. it's, it's dumb. The, the extreme between rich and poor is so vast. Vast. That it's embarrassing to be a human, to sit up here and call yourself a human. And we do this shit. Mm -hmm. We sit up here and give a fuck about, you know, dogs and shit. Dogs and shit, motherfucking dogs and strollers. And, you know, I, hey, I like a dog. I love pit bulls. I love them, uh -huh. but hey, I'm gonna tell you that one of the other reasons I don't own a pet right now is because I'm, I'm a motherfucker who probably go to jail on a pet right now. There's a certain shit that his motherfuckers just like, well, I got a vet bill of four thousand. Huh? What? Uh, Guess uh, what, pal? Right. That's a long ride and a drop off in the mountains. <laughs> exactly. If I'm Mother Nature can't cure you, motherfucker, uh, you, 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 there's a bear out there. You'll be a lovely meal for. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Spike. Let's go up here to Andalus Crest Forest. Andalus <laughs> Forest. You ever been in the forest? <laughs> You're a pit bull. You'll be able to take it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, motherfucker. I'll do that. I believe in that. And if you can't survive in nature, then motherfucker, you, uh, sorry. Drop me off in nature. Yeah. I ain't going to say I'm going to be a Bear grills, but I know how to set up something and stake my ass put, motherfucker. <laughs> set a few traps, nigga. I'll catch a rabbit or something. Yeah, rabbit or something. Can you skin a rabbit? Do you know how to skin a rabbit? Do you know how like a skin a rabbit? I can skin it. If I'm hungry enough, I'll skin any goddamn thing. Yeah. I know that much. Yeah. It may take a couple of rabbits before I get it right. But yeah. <laughs> Still got some meat on But uh, I'm not, you know, I was in the sir, I was in the I was in infantry, man. We we did that. You we, did what? We was in the fucking woods in 45 so you skin days. Animals? Skin snakes and all of that yeah. shit. Did you eat, like skin them and then eat Ate them? Ate them motherfuckers. Park. Panama jungle training. What? Two week course. For Let's real. go. You did. You do that. Hey, yo, man. We was shooting in Germany. We shot a fucking man. And this was not on purpose. Oops. This was not on purpose. But goddamn, it happened. Mom, we was qualifying for fit with the fifty cal, which I'm an expert. You know, I'm a 50 cal expert. That, that's Still? one. Uh, not probably not. You know, give me give me a motherfucking uh, a day. Okay. And I'll good. be back up to par. Okay. Refamiliarize myself with the weapon at hand. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Set my T and E <laughs> on my timing because it's about trigger setting. Mm -hmm. You got a tripod. You go vertical. <laughs> Horizontal. You want that shit to be, you know, you want to be able to write your name with rounds. Right. Ra, okay. ra, 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 all of that. Uh -huh. 50 cows are like, do, 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 do. I'm talking about guns. That's fucked up. But fuck it. I know Why this shit. Why is it shit. fucked up to talk it's about guns? It's fucked up because, you know, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm, a not, I'm a comedian. I'm a loving guy. <laughs> you can like guns. Fun. 50 cows is the shit, man. Yes. If anything comes to battle, man, 50 cow. Yeah. That's 50 the one. cal, the round is this motherfucking big. Oh, shit. Yeah. And I yeah. say that because I've actually seen what the motherfucking round does. We were qualifying in motherfucking Wielflicken, Germany. Wielflicken, mm -hmm. guten Tag. Oh, my God. Watch this. Yeah, they that's that 50 huge. cal, baby. Do, 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 do. You shoot oh. that with your thumbs. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so 50 cal. And, and it has a removal. You got to remove Here, the barrel. Let me see. Yeah, those are the rounds. Big ass rounds. They are about this tall. Massive. And about that much of it is lead. That that is a armor piercing. Uh, they have those in armor piercing, which wow. means that a APC, armed personnel carrier, jeeps, all of that kind of shit, trucks. You get Nate the fuck up with them. Yeah, they got them. Those right there. That looks like it. Oh my lord. That motherfucker will. I saw one of those rounds, about two or three of those rounds, uh -huh. hit a family of uh, what they call guinea pigs. 
Goonie pigs? Goonie, Goonie pig. goonies? Goonie pig is, is motherfucking warthog in German. Oh. Big ass warthog. <laughs> we talking about boars with tusks. These motherfuckers get to be about the size of like a, uh, I say like about a motherfucking, one of them little mini cars. Yeah. The little, the little, uh, the little smart cars. Right, right, right. They're about the size of a smart car. Oh and about God. that quick, it will fuck you up. That animal will fuck yes, you up, human being. Yes, with no motherfucking weapon, no wait, motherfucking a, bow and arrow. A, a, just wait, a warthog? Warthogs. And they will eat your motherfucking ass. That's a pig. That's a wild pig. If you take a pig off the front of little fat pink ones, mm-hmm. put oh, that yeah. motherfucker yeah. in the woods as yeah. a little fat pink bitch. Come back in about three months, you will have a warthog on your hands. They go back to what they are. Yeah, that's what I, I, I remember. Like. Yeah, that's bacon right there. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's a pig on swole. That's a pig. That's, that's motherfucking uh, porky well, do, pig. Do they attack? If, do if, they attack? I mean, no, no, no. I mean, like, it, if you're just in the area, will they attack? Or yes. do they feel threatened? They will attack you to eat you. Just Not because you're fu- there. Just because you're food to them. Okay. Motherfucker, you can't whoop my ass. You're getting angry. Yeah, no. That's nature. Do- nature oh, doesn't have any talking. No, right. No we motherfucking no memos. Right. No motherfucking go to council. None of that, nigga. <laughs> that thing is huge. Nature has, oh, you can't whoop my ass? Yeah. You're eating. Yeah, you must real. be food then, that's, bitch. That's kind of the way it wraps so, up. And then the other part of nature is human beings. I saw what we did to those motherfuckers. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There was a family of those motherfuckers. Now, when you fire, when you qualify with this weapon, right, you fire, like, on from one side of a cliff across a ravine. This is in Germany. This is in Ville Flicken, Germany, which we call Wild Chicken. Mm -hmm. It's a big-ass training area. It's nothing but acres and acres of forest and shit. Okay. So we're over there. We're, like, on one side of a cliff. They got all these targets up on the other side of the cliff. And you have so many targets you have to take down and in order. And it's a whole process. And you get timed on that. That's what determines mm. whether you be an expert or a marksman or a sharpshooter or whatever. I'm an expert. I do my thing with that weapon. Beautiful. Because mm. you, you can set it to your liking. You yeah. can make it so it's kind of hard. Or you can make it so it's like, room, like, do, 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 like, it's going. Cool. But anyway, these pigs was running across the target area. Oh. Just up the side of a mountain. Pigs, wild doing boars, pig corner shit. pigs, doing pig shit. Right. You know, eating, probably looking for truffles. For themselves, <laughs> goddammit. Right. 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 For the goddamn natural myself. pig right. self. <laughs> and man, them motherfucking weapons started clacking. Do, 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 do. Them pigs. <laughs> they took off running. <laughs> Yo. I just saw the mama, the biggest one. You shot the ex- mom. Shot. Exploded that motherfucker. Oh, boy. You shot the mom. <laughs> Quiet. Terrible. Smoke and blood and guts. No. <laughs> yes. I think one of the rounds probably nicked it because it squealed. Right. And the next round, you know, Shut took it out. out. Wow. Like, because it was like. <laughs> Like, from where I was, it sounded like, <laughs> and shit was everywhere. Oh, Pork, baby. you shot the mom. Man, that mom's got lit, exploded to oh, smithereens. Wow. And that's a big, we talking about an animal that's on swole. Mm-hmm. A big-ass animal. Yeah. And smoke was rising up off that motherfucker. And I was like, damn, that's real barbecue right there. Is it real barbecue? Real deal. deal. And the other ones, the little ones was getting lit. The fuck, it was, they was, they was done. There was nothing left. Because mm. it was a whole fucking man. <laughs> soldiers, man. The fuck? Well, that's so terrible. Yeah, so and the motherfuckers shit. got in, in trouble for that. Yeah. The, the military, a lot of shit happens. I'll tell By you something accident. else that happened during that motherfucking training exercise. What? One of them 50 cows had some bullshit ammunition. Oh, well. It's not like that wouldn't be the first time that there's been bullshit ammo or weapons in the military. (coughs) (coughs) This kid. (coughs) Don't worry, that's part of the process. This kid got his head blown the fuck off 
Oh. Because he oh. tried to fire some ammunition mm. that was from the 1940s. And he was in a prone position, the meaning laying down. Oh, and when that weapon hit, that, that center block, that, that, that back piece just blew the back of his dome off. And he was laying there. Mm-hmm. Now that was like, I, I, I saw, I didn't see him. I saw the, the, uh, the green, the green uh, field blanket over him. Oh, oh God. God. And shit, this, we talking about, about probably about 600 motherfuckers saw him. Right. You know, cause they, he was, it was done. It was a wrap. So and the, it was did like that they, make you hesitate the next time you? Uh, it made me hesitate because it, it, it was it. I wasn't firing no old ass ammunition. I didn't give a fuck what they told me. Mm-hmm. Right. So would you check your ammo first, or how could you tell? Well, I, I don't know how you could tell. I could have right. very well been firing but, some old right, shit. Right, right. You know, right. all it was for me was okay. No, 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 no. This is the new shit, Private. <laughs> all right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm doing. Yeah. Yeah. Now I can do my job, Charlie. <laughs> In there, yes, man. absolutely. Yeah. You understand? Absolutely. You, 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 yeah. you was like, yeah, did you see that shit? Blew his shit off, man. Right. right. The kid's yeah. family got paid oh. because they did not. They, they was like, hey, they had to pay up for that one. Right. This but motherfucker damn. wasn't supposed to be firing this shit. This is some shit that was left over here from D Day. Yeah. Right. <laughs> motherfucker, right. it's 1986. Exactly. The fuck are you right. giving right. some shit? Right. Yeah. Right. Like somebody said, well, you know what? Let's fire it off. Probably some old mm. redneck ass mm-hmm. colonel. I think we all are just fire it off. Give it to the truth. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure that Easy happens more time. often than yeah, not. It is yeah. fun to fire that shit though. Right. That's that's that part of the army, and it was. I love that shit. Right. Mm-hmm. That all of that shooting shit, throwing grenades and shit. I like that stuff. Yeah, you do yeah. love that shit. That yeah. shit is another another layer of, of uh, being a human. Right. We went paintballing. That, that is oh, like we went paintballing. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I've not been in the you military. Paint- but this was my my Compared. like feeling like I was in it thing when we went paintballing. Wow. And, and we were like going in and out of like structures, rolling in the Paintballs hurt, huh? Hell yes, they do. Yeah, oh my okay. God, but it was fun. So multiply that feeling to death. <laughs> and it's just like the army. <laughs> <laughs> so take my little paintballing moment and going into the army, right. Uh, ah, I know, <laughs> but I'm just saying. <laughs> That I could dig, I dig that, but uh, I'm not trying to do the military thing. I'll tell so. you the thing about the the other side. That shit is like, you do shit in there that you're like, you have to stop and be like, this is in fucking insane. Yeah. That I'm doing this. I found myself saying that a few times. Mm-hmm. Like, it's insane mm-hmm. that I'm doing this. Mm-hmm. You know, right. this I'm I'm repelling out of a helicopter. This doesn't make sense. Yeah. But I did that shit like it made all the sense in the in world. world. Mm-hmm. They asked me to do that shit today. The fuck out of here. <laughs> I'll, I'll play motherfucking black ops with you. <laughs> paintballing, maybe. Go paintballing like a motherfucker. <laughs> and I'm not even, I'm going to be a ref. I ain't running and diving and shit. Kiss my ass. That shit was fun for you. That's a young man's sport. But for that's real. why everybody in the military is young. Because mm-hmm. right. it takes, you have to be a young, dumb motherfucker to yeah. do the to shit that they well. have you doing. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody of my age be like, yo, check this out. <laughs> yep. I know it says that in the book, but what's really going to happen <laughs> is none of that shit. Is it none of We're going to say it does, though. <laughs> because you need that. Yeah. I don't need that shit. I could walk <laughs> away from all this shit. Oh, shit. I'm that nigga. Yeah. Kiss my ass. <laughs> well, yeah. I fell for that shit once. Oh. I remember I had a cool ass sergeant. This motherfucker, Sergeant uh-huh. Sherman. What up, homeboy? That motherfucker was cool, and that motherfucker got thrown out the army for smoking weed. Oh, I remember it. that shit was that was big shit. And I was like, and I remember saying, "Well, if if you use marijuana, sergeant, then you're done for." You know, they don't allow marijuana in the military. I was like. You said that? And he said, like, Shh. yeah, I told him that. He said, shit, that weed was good, though, man. <laughs> you don't know, Private Farmer. <laughs> you don't know. And I didn't know. Because he said, man, I don't give a shit if they do kick me out. I'm done with this dumb shit anyway. He said, I've been in long enough. I said, but well, what if they put you out and give you an article? You know, because they got the honorable discharge right, and all of that. Right, other than honorable. And- that motherfucker said, motherfucker, I, I went to fucking Panama. 
they, they can never give me anything. They can give me a medical. They can give me, you know, all kind of shit, but it'll never be dishonorable because I actually went and I pulled a few triggers for these motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. That's who the military is. You the hitman squad or big, big Uncle Sam. Right. It's Uncle right. Sam and his, fire, and his cartel called NATO. Mm -hmm. You understand? And if you're one of these hitmen that should do a mission, do something like that. When you carry this out, you should be taken care of for the rest of your life. Right. And your family too. Of course, of course. Now, that's just what it is. When you sign up, you get you do that. You, mm -hmm. you get those benefits. Yes, yeah. That's how come I say to all you vets, go get your benefits. You was a fucking hit man. <laughs> so what? You didn't hit anybody. You was on call to, right? right. Yeah. Right. Try going to sleep knowing that you could be called to be dropped off in a jungle at any given time. For real. For real. Exactly. So I said, get your shit, man. Get it. So, oh, this was um, Lion King weekend. Uh, have you? Oh, you got the look. What? <laughs> what? You don't? You're not feeling Lion King. <laughs> as soon as I said <laughs> Lion King. What's up? Lion King. All of that shit is great. Okay. Well, especially when you got kids. For real. And when you're old. Mm-hmm. You I'm not fuck Lion King. I'm not at. The, I'm <laughs> in the gap that doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> You said you're in the gap. Yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you what I did. Billion people My big weekend it. was watching the Pacquiao fight. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, ain't no joke. Pacquiao, that Filipino. 45, <laughs> 455 punches. <laughs> Pacquiao. <laughs> he gets in the ring with me. I beat, beat his head like, look like chicken wing. When I'm done, his head beat back like lumpia. Pacquiao. I don't care about Lion King. Fuck Lion King. <laughs> Lion King billion dollar corporation. They don't care. If I go see Pacquiao. Just, he's just millionaire. I support, support the little man. <laughs> Filipino. <laughs> I have a portion of my family. Filipino. Oh. It's my family. My, my actual same blood run that my family. Right, right. Filipino. Filipino. That's right. Filipino. Lumpias. Adobo chicken. Adobo. You don't need adobo chicken? <laughs> Mother fuck. Mother Bucks don't know what's good. Oh. Those boys, Mother Buck, those boys, Lion King. Oh Fuck Lion God. King. Lion King don't eat lumpia's chicken. <laughs> Pacquiao eat buckets. Buckets of lumpia's chicken. He had buckets. He beat that mm. man. Beat him, beat him back. Oh, barely beat him. Oh. He barely won. But Was the guy, close? It, it wasn't close, but the other guy had his wife. He bought his wife in the locker room, and I what? knew. Yeah, what the fuck? You going to fight Pacquiao? You getting kiss on cheek from your wife? You dumb mother fuck. You going to get beat, beat bad, beat very bad, very very bad. Four hundred and fifty five punches. Four hundred and fifty five punches to his mother fucking jaw. Then, then you can go back and kiss your wife, and she can kiss your beaten up head. That nigga brought his wife. Wow. Dude was in a fucking the locker, locker room. room per yeah, he, 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 you know, he's a newlywed. He had his wife there. His wife. Nigga, that you're going to lose, smart. you dumb yeah. motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. Why would you do that? That's crazy. You know, I love my wife. I, I, everything I do right. is for my wife. Yeah. I'm that dude. Right. But motherfucker, when you're about to go fight. You're going to bring your wife into the You're going to bring room. your wife? Yeah. Hey, honey, how? Saw him like that. Uh, saw him uh, like that, baby. I saw him, mama. Tell me how I, how I hit him, mama. You dumb motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. I, right then, I was like, this nigga's done. Dead. And his wife, you're no good. <laughs> she said, why would you do that to your husband? Give him some goddamn space to be a man. Uh, Let him get his head together. This motherfucker's <laughs> going to fight Pacquiao. <laughs> he, may, he may have insisted that she got Right, right. That, you know what that says to me? Gold digger. Gold digger. Yeah. No She's casino girl. Casino she girl. She likes having life on party poo. <laughs> she wants to eat the life of party poo. Oh. Shrimp platter. Shrimp oh. platter. Red lobster. She's party girl. She's a party girl. Yeah, she She's don't know. Girl. Look, dumb bitch. This guy's gonna fight back out. Don't, you don't give smoochie woochie. <laughs> fuck is wrong with you? You don't give smoochy with you. He's oh. supposed to have no sex. No sex. Pacquiao don't fuck nobody. Ask his wife. No fucking. No fucking. No fucking. No fucking. I have big pipe. 
<laughs> then bite. I have to wait. All of that pinching, aggression going to be on this guy's jaw. Right. He didn't have that. No. He didn't wow. have There was no, you know, you went from love and warmth mm -hmm. to Pacquiao, nigga. <laughs> and Pacquiao gave you love and warmth, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> wow, wow, wow. <laughs> He's from Florida, too. Oh, God. He had braids like uh, Sean Paul and shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's, you know, Terman, I mean, but hey. But you know what? It was a good deal because guess what? He went to distance. He did go to distance. And mm -hmm. Pacquiao, uh, another reason I knew Pacquiao wasn't going to lose because Pacquiao, uh, what's his name, was in the audience. Yeah, he's in our, come on, he's set up all around. Yeah, this is a setup. This, yeah. You know, it's kind of whack to watch that. He really is. Yeah. And then the, 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 the lower cars that they had. Oh man, the first one was good. That was a good two. You know the these niggas. I don't know what you call these niggas. Fucking onion skin weight. Oh, these motherfuckers. <laughs> that, that, that light. These niggas, onion skin. These niggas was come in and flap feathers on each other. <laughs> <laughs> Look like a parakeet fight. <laughs> no disrespect, these little motherfuckers. Yeah. They, they well, boxers. The they boxers. They, they the warriors. Right. They warriors. Right. Exactly. You know, no offense <laughs> to the small fighters out there. You know, your shit. <laughs> but I'm just saying, motherfuckers, for you to do 100 push-ups and for fucking, right. what's his name? Like, uh, what's my boy with the fucking, uh, with that nigga retired and made a griller. Joe Foreman to do 100 pushes. That's a big deal, nigga. That's a, that's a feat, motherfucker. Yeah. You know, these motherfuckers do... <laughs> hummingbird niggas, man. <laughs> so that fight was good. One hummingbird, the one hummingbird knocked out the other hummingbird. When he knocked him out, it looked like that nigga found a, a like a like a trap door in the in the in the, in the, in the like in the ring. Like this nigga looked like he just walked downstairs. <laughs> He's like, ha, 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 I'm gonna go down to the dead. <laughs> That shit was hilarious. Oh. That nigga just went. And then the next one was was <laughs> the next one was hilarious. That is Cuban Cuban brother. Y'all know his name. Uh Guan Guan Gu some. He this motherfucker, he had the, the the he had the crazy ball spot. This nigga had the twin peaks, the twin <laughs> ball spots, like a saddle print ball spot. <laughs> and he was in there scrapping. <laughs> <laughs> if you'd have painted this ball spot red, it would have looked like a fucking a black widow spider on his back. <laughs> that nigga had that ball spot, oh my God. and he was in there and he was going in. He was scrapping. The nigga looked, he was, dude, my man, you. He looked like he rode his bike up to that motherfucker, man. <laughs> looked like he rode his bike up to that. Like, like he took his book bag. I'm gonna go fight. <laughs> And after the fight, I'll be able to come back and close, okay, man? I'll be back. He was just like that dude. Like, this smartphone is, you know, and the guy he fought was a fucking dickhead to me. This motherfucker had no trainer. He's a self trained boxer. Oh, wow. Yeah, I forget his name. I, yo, y'all know these court? niggas' name. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Who the fuck he is that? He is he's self taught. So these are motherfuckers he paid. Now, look here. I want you to come down and pretend like you're giving me tips. I'm self taught, so I'm not going to listen to any of you. <laughs> and when he got out there and was scrapping, it was obvious you were self taught. Nigga, you, you're not boxing. You're fighting the motherfucking day shift manager, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is going on here, man? <laughs> oh and, uh, my God. He got knocked down. He got knocked. No, no, no. That was that was Pacquiao that knocked the other dude. Mm. The uh, my man Thurman. Right. Pacquiao knocked him down. He uh -huh. he did the. Uh, that nigga looked like he hit the re the recliner on his car. He's like, mm. <laughs> <laughs> bow. Mm. Oh. Like he was just like on some bulls. Like anyway, it was a good fight weekend. So I didn't see Lion King. Okay. But um. <laughs> well. It's okay. Is we it? Didn't. It's supposed. And what the big? Well, what's well the big it's because deal it's all this whole new technology was created for it, where it's like the whole live action film. I think there's only one actual uh, look, shot from off, Africa in let there. Let me tell you something. I don't like the Lion King because I feel personally that you motherfuckers robbed us somehow. Because that's the story of the black man, motherfucker. 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And you know it was. That's why you name these motherfuckers names like Mustafa and shit. Because you just Mufasa. couldn't steal it. Mustafa, Mustafa. They they right. changed it to Mufasa so they could sell it so Mustafa wouldn't come down. There. <laughs> <laughs> that was what it was. <laughs> but to me, it's a subliminal story. Oh, it's a fabulous story. It's, it it, it's, if you look at it, if they just if they just had a, a black family instead of a gang of lions. Mm-hmm. Huh. Mm-hmm. But it did. We they would tell that story. The, it's it's the the whole African and then the the vibe from the South African choir. All of that is what made it resonate with the world. Yeah, I know. But I mean, you know, from people the motherland. Got ripped off and shit. The, Some the, pe- the people who sang the first one. That 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 part. That was a motherfucker, man. That was somebody who actually did that on a freestyle. <laughs> And they, yeah, they For real? freestyle. Yeah, freestyle. he was a freestyling. And uh, dog, no, right? we be up, we be up. That's no, all. you're mm-hmm. talking about the lion sleeps tonight. Yeah, yeah, Which they, don't they the use that? King. They don't yeah. use that in no. Lion King. No, it is in Lion. King. The lion. I don't know if it's in this version of the um, animation version. That wasn't it. Oh, yeah. really? I don't yeah, know. I, I, because uh, Pumbaa and other characters. Yeah, sing. Pumbaa and all. You know. Okay. I don't know, but you know, when you got kids, you know, my kids are, they're grown, so don't be no motherfucking Lion King paying to see shit. When that shit come on, whatever, I might catch it. Yeah. I mm-hmm. might catch that shit. Netflix. Tell you, you want to see a good movie? <laughs> mm-hmm. Jimmy Walker and Felicia <laughs> Rashad. In what? Oh my goodness. What's the name of that movie? The, the visuals are already. Oh my God. What is the movie with Jimmy Walker and Felicia Rashad? This is probably, I'm sorry, this is the. You know One the of movie? the worst motherfucking movies I've seen. The greatest thing but, that almost happened. The greatest thing that almost happened. Wow. Jimmy Walker's old ass is playing a high school student. Oh. Yo. Really? Go see that. Go watch it. Not go see it. Pull that shit up. You want to laugh? You got to watch that shit. You got to get you some bomb-ass <gasps> trees. Like today, I got some motherfucking, um, what is this shit I'm smoking today? I know that. Yeah, what it, yeah, okay. The greatest thing that I, oh, from 1978? Oh, wow. Look at him. Oh, I think I have some, seen this. I'm on some, I got Gorilla Glue. It's, it's from 77. GG4. Okay. Are you doing Gorilla your Gorilla Glue? Four. Yeah, okay. I just had a, it was a, I had a dispensary in downtown. I was going to say their name, but I was like, look, oh, Robert I can Hose say your name it? if you want to recognize. I can oh say God. your name on this show. It's like, oh, no, nah, that's going to be, well, fuck you then, bitch. I ain't saying y'all's name. So you don't know where I got this, but it's Gorilla Glue 4. I will give props to the motherfucker. Right. right. <laughs> wow. Certain dispensaries I give shouts out to. Right. The ones that look out. The ones that don't. No problem. It's all business. It's all business. You know. Wow, it's Debbie Allen. Oh, Debbie Allen. Not Felicia 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 Felicia. Yeah, it's Debbie Allen. Sorry, Debbie Allen, her yeah. sister. Uh huh. Yeah, right. I get them mixed up. It's okay. They're both fabulous. Yeah, they they dope. Yeah. But okay, so here's the one thing that I one of the things of the many things that I because I love the whole Lion King story, blah blah blah. But the the young man who sang, um, uh, he's saying, I I just can't wait to be king. It's a young guy. His name is uh, Linda. J G McQuarrie. What? I don't know the names of these songs. Okay. It, well, okay. Everybody who likes The Lion King knows this when well, he's little. Guess he's what? talking about he can't wait to be king. Anyway, I can't just wait listen. to be king. Yeah, right. If I'd have wrote the song, I can't wait to be king, they wouldn't like that shit. <laughs> but I would if I can't wait to be king. And I'm going to tell you one thing. That if you can't make potato, potato salad, you get your head cut off. All your bitches line up. All your bitches line up. Now go in the kitchen to make some potato salad. If that shit. Ain't right, oh. bitch. Say goodnight. <laughs> I was motherfucking king. Hold on, now if I was king, all my homies would have the money. Oh. Everybody I know would be happy with money. And if you don't know me, then you'd have to become my friend. Now look out, and if you was in me, I'd beat your monkey ass. If I was king, if I was king. All you silly crackers that making these phone calls to the police will be the worst deed of them all. I make sure you get hooked up to four elephants and pull the fuck apart. And we would not even rinse the blood from your 
your punk ass and set that shit on fire. If I was king, your motherfucking. Oh my god. Get high. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, on the real, congratulations, congratulations, that's, congratulations, now listen, get your self-esteem together, because <laughs> obviously you have a lot of self-esteem, now get your self-esteem together, you know what I mean, and if you don't, well then kid, you're in for a fucked up ride, yeah. get your self-esteem together, play in the arena that it's being played, yeah, right. yeah. I'm not one of those dudes. I don't believe in taking over the fucking entertainment industry. I'm a black man. I'm going to take this. Man, shut the fuck up. <laughs> you didn't, it, this is, we didn't invent this industry. Uh-huh. We did not. No, no. We so did, you did take not. Advantage this, we did of not it. invent this industry. Right, right. Yo, motherfucker, we are talented. Yeah. We've been the fuel that this fucking industry was built with. For, there you go. Definitely. There you yeah, go. Oh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. But we did not build this industry. Right. So guess what? Get in here, get your fucking money, mm -hmm. and then diversify, motherfucker. Diversify. Just well, sell some motherfucking, some voice of Lion King potato chips, nigga. Whatever the <laughs> fuck it is, nigga. Well, I'm looking forward. I'm get looking Get some gumballs, nigga. It. The nigga that made Lion King gumball. <laughs> yeah. What's his name? Uh, J.D. McCary. J.D. McCary. Carey. McCary Combs. <laughs> Keep your fro like a man. <laughs> you you can sing, a, <laughs> sing your own motherfucking uh, jingle, man. Get to uh, okay. it. Okay. We need a health tip, Polly. Yes. Watermelon, motherfucker. Oh, Sometime. wait. Ta da Watermelon. Do you want some? No. <laughs> Why? Here, I'm going to get, I'm sharing with you. You don't want no, any? thanks. Why? He said no thanks. You're eating, totally eating watermelon wrong. Oh, because I was that just like. That's that motherfucking that European. The, right the only way uh -huh. that you're supposed to eat it, and this is, we have to pause. I say watermelon. First of all, shouts out to my brother, Jay Muhammad, because he said, freeze, you got to say watermelon. For what? Watermelon for a fucking, uh, for a health tip. Right. Yes. Watermelon is healthy as fuck, man. Yes. Yeah, if the plan is to fuck us up, you know what they do. They always hide the truth right up underneath your nose. Mm -hmm. So if they don't want you to eat watermelon, they're going to give you some kind of a complex. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, yeah. there you go. To, to make more for themselves, motherfucker. Yeah. You think right. I don't know. But um, this reminded me of a clip. Mm -hmm. And this is a clip in comedy. Oh. Petey Green. Hello. Miss Benjamin, yeah. Now, I know you said no. That's an ignorant nigga. But this is a sweet one, man. Right, right. He, his comedy and how he gets down was, it was um, truly free as a comedian. Right. To me, that's, that's, that's what it's about. Getting to that level to where you can really be comfortable and open with your deepest motherfucking self. Yes. Your, your vulnerability. Just express Completely it. transparent. Not giving a complete fuck. Right. And being f hilarious. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> he did this this bit. If you look it up on, on YouTube or maybe we could we could find it or something and pull I'll it up. Put it up, mm -hmm. put it up man, because yes. this is Petey Green killed it. This right. is, and that's how I feel about water. Right. I, I'm not even, but what you're doing right there to a real. Yeah, no, what's the problem with it's it? It's just, you know. Because it's not. It's very not, European. It's oh. in a bell. <laughs> See, that's I'd like no, to eat that's some watermelon. That's, that's no. Yeah, they no. eat watermelon right now in fucking Buckingham Palace because <laughs> our homegirl, Megan Markle, took it over there. <laughs> now, look here. Come on, cousin, 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 cousin. Come on, raw cousin. What up now? Yeah, yeah, Auntie Duchess is in this motherfucker. Now, let me tell y'all something. Some y'all motherfuckers got to have. This is called Walter Melon. I don't give okay. a fuck. Okay. You got to hear this, all right? This Walter Melon. Okay. I'm from L.A. Now, we get down with fucking Walter Melon. We don't give a fuck about no motherfucking nothing. 
Okay, so we can finish no talking about it. We have complex. to say bye, but we can keep talking. Who has to say bye? You do. No, I don't. Y'all yeah. say bye. Cut okay. it off. I'm going to be here. Okay. You think cut it off? I'm going to be say, here. Right. Okay. So CD watermelon right. with a fork and a bowl. Right. Very fine. Okay, so thank you all for being Europeans here. Europeans' hand is all over that watermelon. Right. I don't want it. Subscribe. Petey Green to show you how to eat watermelon. Yeah. That's how you fucking eat watermelon. Okay. If you can't eat watermelon like this, it's like so Petey Green good. says, say I can't take want. no credit. Mm. That's how I try to eat watermelon because that's freedom, goddammit. That's what being a motherfucking descendant of a slave in America is about, is eating watermelon like motherfucking Mr. Petey Green. Watch that shit. 30 oh. calories, 91% water. Wait, see y'all next week. Okay. Protein, yep. carbs, sugar. all of that. It's all, it's all. From the earth. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. I'm fine. Mm. No, I'm. I don't want. Look how it's perfectly it's cut. That's that we European have, shit. That's probably some Japanese. Really, oh, yeah. we have cut the water. It's, man. it's scooped out with an oh, ice cream scoop scoop out. We, you don't even know if that's the heart or the upper edge. You don't what know. When I eat wild watermelon, I know exactly what it's going to be. It. A ball. It's going to be fabulous. It that motherfucker is going to be spectacular. Right. Every seeds. Oh, make sure your watermelon's got seeds, too. Mm-hmm. And another thing, if you see them big cracks in it, yo. That shit's no good. Why? Because those cracks come from motherfucking pesticides. Ha! Yeah. Ah. Yeah. yeah, learn that shit. Yeah. Just look up watermelon as much as you, it's all over. Go get a few things and find out. But it is off the chain. And it's easier to take it to work this way. I got you. Than it is to but you know what I'm saying? I want you to watch Petey Green I, eat watermelon and get you a piece of watermelon and eat it like him tomorrow at work. Either you're either going to get a raise to the president of the company or you're going to get fired. <laughs> but, Go yo, with it. <laughs> I expressed my love for this video to somebody and I got fired. Really? Yeah. From where? The cable company? No, no. I'm not even going to say. But they looked at me and he's like... Oh. They thought that was racist and shit. Were like, they black or white? They, you know what? I'm not even going to say. Okay. They, was, they were a human. Yo, I'm, I'm going to show it to you. I'm going to show you. Oh, it's that's gonna crazy. It's going to be reenacted in something. I'm going to do the whole story. But it was funny. But, I, you know, it's, it's it didn't really get me fired, but it just, like, kind of put, like, <laughs> put the brakes <laughs> on <laughs> everything. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's some this is some entertainment and it was just, career yeah, shit. Yeah, some career shit. Oh, and it wow. was like, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker will go there with funny? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. This yeah. is, uh, I, I'm talking NBC. This is, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, it's, the, it's the truth that makes the funny. But it is. But you know what I'm really saying? But it's all it good. I don't hold nothing. Because to me, it was like, if you don't see the humor in this right. and you can't yeah. laugh with right. this, yeah. then really... Motherfucker, you're not on my level. That's right. Mm-hmm. For real, for real, and you'll be a hindrance. And working with you would be a hindrance in the long run. Because mm-hmm. I know where the fuck I'm at out here. Because, see, that's the best thing about my shit. Right. Is my shit has been shown me directly to my face all over this motherfucking world. Sold out seats via my man Charlie Murphy. God bless that dude. Mm-hmm. Yo, I cracked many a motherfucking stage. Right. Many a big show, many a tiny show. Every big, huge, whatever doesn't matter. Yeah. I've cracked him face on, face on. I know what the fuck funny is. Yeah, man. One hundred percent, like which, undoubtedly. Uh, Eddie I, 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 is about to um, apparently getting like seventy million from Netflix or something like that to do um, a, a stand-up special. Brother, let me tell you, that's a bargain. <laughs> that, because for, let I'm me tell you, man, now, that uh-huh. dude, hey. Motherfucker, it will be epic. yo. You, a lot of you motherfuckers about to see what we've been seeing, mm-hmm. what we know yeah. about the world's about to see. Because some people, and I'm, I can say I'm one of them. God damn it, I'm not. I'm not. As, I know I'm one of them. Motherfuckers are put here, and being funny and doing this crap is is certain. Certain motherfuckers are touched. Mm-hmm. He is not only touched. He's been massaged <laughs> by the laughter gods. <laughs> Do you? I, yeah. I know this firsthand. You gotta understand. I held the boom on this dude's head over mm-hmm. this dude's head mm-hmm. for an entire film. I saw this man walk into movie sets 
rattle off the fucking script. I mean, the, I mean, like verbatim the fucking uh, script, everything written on the script, and then say, now, can I give you what I want to do, or can I give you my take? And they said, absolutely, fucking money. <laughs> They said absolutely, and that's where the money was, well, baby. Right, where he so my man came in as a professional, handled the work to the, right. I mean, <laughs> everything you could want him, you visualize he did. Right. 100. And then iced it with, and now let me show you what I could do just off the motherfucking dome. Mm -hmm. Because I want to. Mm -hmm. And that shit is, is butter. It's golden. It's fucking platinum. It's yeah. all of that, and I'm funny. Mm -hmm. So, I I I look at that that him coming out. That's that's awesome. That's big. It's seventy five mil. They got it cheap. They got it cheap. If you ask me. Yeah. Yeah. It's but fuck it. This is this is my culture. This dude here. You don't understand, motherfuckers. There's no comedian in our time that has still done what he's done. Right. Uh, Dave all. Chappelle, I love you, brother. He's done some spectacular shit. Mm. But it's not Eddie Murphy. Yeah, yeah. Eddie Murphy was a phenomenon. Is a phenomenon. Phen is a phenomenon. Right. Yeah, yeah. Is a phenomenon. Yeah. And when it's not, you know. I know where I'm at. Check my motherfucking special finally freeze love. F2 to all double E and the Z. Don't have another E because that's not me. Me, me, me. Freeze love. I'm keeping that shit. Yeah. Then check the album. I'm not going to tell you the name of the album, but it's, it's all. I'm good.